What is up, my dudes? Nate here, and we're back with another episode of Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. Uh, last time, we... Ooh. Kind of looked into what to expect from the game, but of course I already kind of knew. Wow, you found uh, a lucky charm. That'll protect you when you take any damage. Oh, good, so it's not just like a one-hit thing. I actually have... Probably two hits now. Well, there was one of them. That was a uh, good job, Nate. Immediately wasted. Okay, anyways. So, I'm familiar with like a lot of the mechanics because they, they exist in future games, but the actual... Well then, just that voice acting. We're gonna look and see if any any subtitles, any. Nope. Okay. No subtitles, guys. Sorry. Let's do this. Better close those furnace doors. Jump and press the square button. That'll slam them shut. Eureka! We're in the engine room! My analysis tells me that if you trace the spinning crankshaft all the way back to its source, You'll find Raleigh's treasure key and sabotage his machine while you're at it. Oh, ooh. Almost got hit. Let me back up. Let me back up. Okay. Remember, Sly, hold down the circle yes, button you. near the blue mm. stealth auras to perform super sneaky thief moves. Super sneaky. Got it. I really hate tutorials, guys. I hate them. Especially because, like, it's especially bad because I know this game. Like, I've, well, I know how to play this game already because I've played all the others. They all play the same. And it's all, like, circle button. It's either standing at the circle button or jumping at the circle button. It's really not rocket science. But, ah, so good. So good. I, I do, like, I'm loving this already. Can you, can you not? Is this gonna... Well... That was a fail. I can't even get back up, can I? I just... Oh, that's annoying. I'm glad I am not completing this one. <laughs> Oh, and for those wondering, I'm actually playing, like, the HD remastered version of this for the PlayStation 3. I'm not playing the original, uh, because this was originally on the PlayStation 2, and I said that, no, I'm gonna play remastered bust. Because PlayStation, this on the PlayStation 2, nowadays looks pretty poopy. So, yep.
Oh, man, I, I made it. <laughs> Thought I was gonna die there. Oh, good. Another one of these. Doing so bad. <laughs> So bad. It's okay. It's okay. I'm still like progressing. I'm just not getting any of like clues. already expecting to have 30 already. Oh, Every time, I really do not like those hammer dudes. You can't jump up on this furnace, Sly. You better go back and find an alternate route. Thank you. Ew, I didn't notice that. It looks really gross. Oh, I see it. Oh, there's more clues. Oh, well, not worried. Dang. Okay, another key. Wow. Another key! I think that's alive. Moving right along. Jackpot, Sly! Look at all this stuff! Must be worth millions! And you know what that means? Tighter security. You're gonna have to be extra sneaky to get the treasure key here. Super sneaky! Oh god. It's a shame he hides all his money in this, like, really... Uh, expensive stuff, so I have to break it to get the money. It's a shame. Just means I'm gonna have to smash it all to get my muns. Muns. Okay. Okay. What?
I I did not expect any of that. Well, uh, I'm too lazy to go back and get all the re-smash all the stuff, so. So how? I just run? There's something down there. Those are more bottles. Okay. say as a critique of this first game Dude, this is the vault, but you need more clues. yes I know I know as a critique of this game it's just like every level is just like here's a bunch of freaking clues and you have to get them all like uh... well you don't have to get them all but just like to just throw like mass amounts of stuff like there's two clues right by each other you could have just had one there you didn't need that many clues Really? All right then. All righty then. Okay. No trespassing. Just gonna just gonna get rid of those signs. Okay. Best way around this. Oh, God. Well, good. <sighs> Checkpoint. Uh, oh, these are lights. Probably shouldn't trigger those alarms. Almost made it, though. Almost beat another level, guys. Making all the progress. Um. Oh, good. Oh, God. This one hit kill thing is not, not my, not my jam. I'm really not used to that. The other games, like, again, they, they take, they take a really different approach to the same, like, it's a new formula. Same kind of game, same controls and everything, they just go a different route with it. So. Okay, and we're back out. And on that note, guys, we will go ahead and call it a second episode now. You kind of see uh, what to expect from the game. Um, more or less, as far as I can tell, you go to an area, you go in and do these various, like, platforming missions. Uh, you collect the clues. Yeah, you get, you get the key to go 
do basically do the end level with a boss and everything, and that's that's pretty much the game. Uh, but it has a lot of character, a lot of cool locales, um, and there is some new platforming stuff that they add in. So don't don't get too bored just yet. It is a lot of fun. So just stick with it, guys. Uh, and then, of course, like I said, the other games are really freaking tight, too, so it's worth it. Uh, so we will see you guys, as always, next time. Bye bye <laughs>